Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse who I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoe. Hey everybody, welcome back to a quick beer review. Uh, it is Christmas Day. I want to wish all you guys who celebrate Merry Christmas. I uh, appreciate you guys hanging out again this year uh, on the channel. It's always fun drinking beer with you guys. Uh, figured for our Christmas Day beer review, we would review a Christmas-themed beer. It is not a stout. Stoutness was a fail this year, but um, from Slice Beer Company, Lincoln, California. This is Old Man Marley. They continued the uh, Home Alone-themed Christmas beer this year. Last year, they did uh, Little Nero's and Sticky Bandits. And this year, they did um, Old Man Marley, and then they did... South End Shovel Slayer, I think it was called. Um, but this is a, it says Friendly Hazy IPA. This is a West Coast style I, uh, hazy IPA, I do believe. Um, and it is hopped with Mosaic, Nectaron, and fan, uh, Phantasm. So um, I am super stoked on uh, on this beer, 7%. So love the Home Alone theme, Old Man Marley. Home Alone to me, best Christmas movie of all time. It is my favorite Christmas movie of all time. Um, so yeah, let's do it. Canned on December 10th, so we are 15 days in the can. Two weeks. Should be about perfect. Uh, big thanks to my man Jared for hooking this one up, as always. He is my slice beer angel. Ooh, this beer is light. This uh, is immediately reminding me of um, McElhaney's uh, months that we just drank. Oh, it is super, super light. Love it. So, um, yeah, I say it every time I drink one, the West Coast style hazy IPAs are my favorite hazy beer these days, um, just because it gives like a beer aspect to a hazy beer. It's not just juice, but we'll see how this one is. Yeah, super, super pale. Um, it looks like lemonade in the glass to me. Um, it is hazy, but not like super turkey gravy murky. It's just glowing. It probably looks a little bit darker on camera, but finger of fluffy bright white head. Using our sliced glassware, because you guys know beer tastes better in proper glassware. Let's show our fat nose in it. Let's see what's got. 11.30 a.m. Christmas morning, first beer. LFG. <sighs> this beer smells really good. Um, this is very, like, berry fruity. Um, it even has, like, a cool, like, white winey kind of a thing. It's peachy. It smells like juice. It smells like a juice box. Um, I don't get a whole lot of West Coast vibe from this. There might be a little bit of like green hot matter, but this is super juicy, soft, um, soft in like terms of like being very fruit juicy forward, uh, but very intense. I don't mean to say like the nose is not um, intense by saying it's soft, but this is very soft, inviting, like juicy haze. But it's not like yeasty and it's not like heartburny. Um, it just smells really, really good. <sighs> yeah, man. Like nectar, nectaron, right? Is that what we said? And phantasm. Yeah, they're just like phantasm is very. Um, it kind of reminds me of Nelson, but nectaron is just so stone fruity. I love it. And then you just get that cool like berry thing from the mosaic. I was hoping there was going to be like that cool, like danky thing that mosaic usually gives off, but this is just super juicy fruit hops. So let's go and taste it. Cheers! Merry Christmas. That's delicious. A um, little bit of like hot bite on the very end of that, but this is just crazy, juicy, just fruity hops. This is haze without being like heavy. Like I said, it's not yeasty. Um, it just like lets the hops express themselves. Like the, the flavors are so good. This is delicious. Yeah, it's berry, stone fruity. This does, this has like a juice box vibe to me. A Little bit of like, just a tiny bit of green hot matter right on the middle of your tongue, but it flies away. Um, this beer is very dry on the finish. You get like that kind of Nelson-y vibe, dry kind of white winey thing. Um, but this at 7% is just an absolute crusher. Like you could chug this thing. Um, <clears throat> and I just like how light it is. I like how it's not super heavy hazy if that makes sense. Like I've seen pictures recently of hazy beers that just, it they look gross and everyone's like, oh my gosh, that looks so good. It looks fucking disgusting to me. Like it looks like they look like they'd be a chore to drink. 
like it just looks like heartburn in a glass and everyone's like going nuts over it this is like if if all the hazy beers tasted like this like i'd be back on the haze train i think there might even be like a cool like kind of sort of like orange pith but without going bitter like if you could imagine like zesting an orange and not having it be taste like intensely bitter just like that awesome like orange oil without bitterness does that make any sense at all it kind of has that this is really really good love it it'll be fun to drink the uh west coast one but if you're into hazy beers like I'd, i'm interested to see what the check-ins are and untapped for this i'm pretty sure people will be going nuts over this beer because it's absolutely freaking delicious so uh world-class stuff from slice we'll leave it at that that's old man marley phantasm and nectaron are quickly becoming two of my favorite things to drink as far as hops go I don't know if I've had a lot of Phantasm or Nectaron in clear beers, but in hazy beers, they're really, really good. I just love how light this is. I love how it's not a fucking yeast cake, and I just love like the juicy, fruity hops you get out of it. So, yeah, that's it. You guys have a great day. Uh, happy holidays to those who don't celebrate Christmas. Are we still in Hanukkah? Is Hanukkah over? Was it? Shoot. Maybe. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Kwanzaa. Happy whoever, whatever you celebrate. So, I uh, appreciate you guys. Appreciate you guys watching, and I will see you very soon. Cheers. Thank you for coming behind the bar in the arcade. All that shit. Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse, so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoes.